Hello, Paul here from EMD Automotive. Got a Porsche 996 on this uh, Porsche 996 Carrera 911. Uh, this one here is a 3.6. If you want to, if you want to know the difference between a 3.6 and a 3.4, very easy. 3.6 have two solenoids here, one here and one there. One is for the lift, and one is for variable timing. Okay, very easy. If you got two of those, if you got one extra one, you got a 3.6 liter. If you only got one of those, that means you only got, you only have a 3.4 liter. 3.4 only had, the, didn't have the valve lift. Okay, 3.6 had the valve lift. It's basically the same engine, a bit more uh, bored out, bigger pistons, um, but the actual, um, the bore is a little, little bit bigger to make it fit from 3.4 to 3.6, but the main difference is this, this one and that one there. Valve lift, variable timing, adjust it. Anyway, um, this one here is all taken out. <coughs> this one, I've taken the bearing out, I've got my... Uh, Parts already last week. I'm sorry, did, yeah, last, this week. I got my flywheel already, so I don't like to do the work. When the, I don't like to actually um, do a little bit, do a little bit, do a little bit. I want to get all my parts and just assemble the car and finish it. It's better that way rather than putting things apart and leaving it open. So, okay, so I've got the actual bearing out. <coughs> These are bearings here. This is the bearing for the for the 996. Right here, still intact, but better to do it now because um, it's a known issue. I've got the front off as well, I've got the exhaust off as well here, I've got the front off as well, brackets off and all that. So I can do the, uh, I'm gonna clean that later. So I can do the oil feed with a modified drive. That's the original, original one there, so I'm gonna do that as well. Seal it all up. I've got to do, replace the water pump as well because I've got a brand new water pump with the customer. I've done the spark, I've done the spark plugs and the actual um, ignition coils. As you can see, that's all done. Both sides. So I'm just going to assemble, put the new bearing in, put the modified uh, uh, drive oil feed from the other side. And then, pretty much a uh, clutch, new clutch, new flywheel, new um, new one of these. That's the actual uh, clutch slave cylinder, and a new oil cooler because the oil cooler is already leaking. If you look here, that's from the oil cooler leaking already, and coming down here as well. So I've got a new oil cooler as well. All right, so. Next week is pretty much assembled and uh, put the engine back in the car. Alright? Thanks for watching and please subscribe.